have to stick the paws up, then down into the spot. And the bats can go around and go in. We have two picks to hold it up. We made this waterproof bat home with a sign. And the reason why it's see-through so is that nobody mistakes it for a burned house or anything so that the bats are protected. What? And waterproof, like I mentioned. Um, we made a little house, um, a bat home. Um, and they can go under and they can get some food in here um, and hang up some Our Our group made this bat home. The bats can crawl through here. There's spikes on the top so no predators can get in. And there's a sign that says keep out for the people so they can't get, they won't disrupt the bats while they're sleeping during the winter. So I made a bat home, a bat cave for the winter. So whenever, so since bats are in danger, I made this little bat home. And there's a moving door. And there's food inside for berries, for like the fruit bats or anything. And that's it. So we invented this because bats are in danger right now. You can pull this yellow leather and make the sun go up and down. And here, you can back and like hold it up. And there's a, like a secret entrance. And inside are all like trees and things. And you use this color of silicone, because if it's in the water, the like no one can see it. And this says back home. Um, this, um, will the bats go, go in? They go in through um, cups and they, um, go, um, through the cups to the bats will crawl inside and in they'll the fly over and they'll the crawl into a little hole and then they'll sleep. So they will just have to lay down instead of hang upside down.